Montana Wobo. Here are our officials, Steve Coleman, a veteran Big South Conference official. Nick Heater, son official, rounding out this crew. Longwood on the attack in the first possession of the game. Averaging 67 points per game, and there's a three. Oh, with a miss, Wobo the rebound for Longwood. They kick it out. And a miss for Badowski. Badowski's a kid that you have to keep an eye on. There's just a miscue by... And now a blocking foul on Xavier Cook. Well, something on tape. Jones and Lopez in for the first time. Winthrop saw it. Put those bone crushing picks. And now a three from Keon Johnson. He comes out of the pack. That's the type of thing Long will do, Mike, with that outlet rebound right there. They'll go double the ball. Into Lopez. Kiss off the glass. Good. Cooks run down the middle of the floor and then get the ball and then score around that rim. They do a great job of running the floor. Now a steal by Keon Moore. Takes it to the rim. Layup is good. Eagles the first three of the game. And Longwood wants a timeout. Half court offense. Wobo now in the paint. He will work. That was a line drive shot by Shaq Johnson. I'll tell you what, Mike, he just works the community, he works the student body. He's, he's very good for winter. Wobo kicks it out, and now Fisher on the reverse layup. So the Let me go back to George. Oh, absolutely. Here's Henry in traffic. Kiss off the glass, good. Yes, he does. And he uses it too. He'll bang with you. Fisher has some good handles displayed there and gets the, the dish for Novo for the dunk. That's got to be backside help by the Eagles right there when that guy goes to double team and help out. And a good take to the rim by Keon Johnson. He's hit because Novo, uh, he would have got that thing. So Winter back within one, and now a dunk by Shaq Johnson. He's shooting 33% from, from behind the arc, too, so he's a dangerous in-out type player. Keon Johnson back on the floor for the Eagles, and here lifts up for the... It's like a heavyweight fight right now, Mike. Nobody really knows, you know, what to do in and out, except for what Longwood's doing, driving, driving to the basket. Almost missed there by Keon Mori and the Eagles. And the Lancers both with losing records in their non-conference schedule. Of course, in the Big South Conference, a one-bid league and a corner of three. Back to Badowski, who started this game. Out of the ball handler, Allen. Of course, I want to get it inside to the big man, working on Lopez, Wobo, and he takes it on the freshman. And now up ahead for Obi Rapu, and Xavier Cooks fights for the rebound. Quickly up ahead to Lopez. The turnaround off the glass, good. Nice little. Davenport back up top for Johnson. Got the ball in the hands of some shooters right now is Keon Moore. You know there are two lumberjacks in there. Dubio KK at 230, 255 for Wobo. And Badowski with another. Now Andre Smith, baseline. Back up top to Keon Moore. Good shot fake. And off the rim and in. Boston ended up being a lost art for a lot of players, but not for Keon Moore. No, he, he uses it extremely well to get the shot. Wow, what an amazing dunk right there by Shaq Johnson, taking it baseline, and now the lead back to four for Longwood. Well, Mike, you had mentioned he's one of the top jumpers in, in, in the country, and I'll tell you what, he would, he left from outside the paint. How about Jared Scott outside for three? Jared Scott has a feathery touch from out there, Mike. You know, you could almost say he has a European type game as a four is another good take to mention when you take a 6'10 player out there and do that and then you can pound them back inside. Four points for Allen. Averages six a game and there's Julio KK in with a flush of his own. So the next follow on Longwood and that'll put Winthrop in the bonus. And now Smith up top for three. And Longwood getting the ball and now in transition. Say Longwood does a great job of beating that baseline. And Badowski was kind of left alone out there. Like anytime you have a player shooting 37%, you have to locate him quickly. Here's Cooks for three. Rims in and in. Pops up and bounce back. Getting a little bit taller defensively. Now Wobo with it. Takes it hard to the rim. Basket and a foul. 
The Eagle reach far and wide. It's good to see. What's the basketball here in the second half? Eagles have Cooks and Lopez to start out, and Andre Smith starts out with a three. Now Smith in the corner, Moore. Off balance shot for Moore, no good. Rebound to Lopez, sit back, good. They seal off Johnson, now Wobo for three in the corner, air balls it. Now with the shot clock running down. Now to the opposite side for Keon Moore, good for three. I'll tell you what, when he gets he's done a nice job, Mike, of getting those long rebounds in the second half. Moore for three, good. Forcing Longwood to take it down to the shot clock. Kick out to Moore, he's got the hot hand. Count it, another triple. That's a, just a little bit too strong. And the Eagles lead by a dozen here, 48-36. And now a bank inside. If that, if that, he is a man. Wobo working on OKK. The turnaround hook shot, good. That yep. Lopez had tipped it. So the Eagles giving one way there, even though it was a tremendous effort. And uh, what a nice turnaround there. Very the Eagles have not really got to that double team quick enough. And he's got the two jump hooks going on. Lopez underneath to Cooks, basket to foul. Getting into their half court offense. Good passing. Scott sealed off. Moore in the corner for Smith for three. Good with a 22 to play. And that's the difference where Longwood has not figured out how to shut that three ball down. And now a nice turnaround by Taylor. And a technical foul on Taylor for taunting. That wasn't a smart move when you're down by Jack Johnson. Taylor will bring it up for Longwood on the sideline. Fisher up top of three, and it's good for Taylor. Shot clock under 20. Into Lopez. Lopez works in the lane. The floater is good. I'll tell you what, he's but Longwood, a very dangerous team. Averaging 67 points per game, they're at 53 right now. Wobo in traffic, basket and a foul. To the basket, pick and roll. Now they get it in the short corner. Now Shaq Johnson goes hard to the rim for the layup. Getting sealed off, finds Johnson. Johnson in traffic, the right hand leader, no good. Cooks gets the rebound, but he loses it. And now up ahead, Longwood for Johnson. And he misses! The stick back is good! <laughs> Try and reclaim the lead. Well, Moore. Keon Moore hadn't had too many open looks right now. And a floater by Xavier Brooks. Let's see what they can do with it in an all even game of 65. Keon Moore steps up for three. Good! Keon Moore! You preferably don't want to give up two either, obviously, but. Basket and a foul wouldn't go so well either here. And there's Johnson. With He's the just pecking away. Little here, little there. And now the Eagles need to clamp down defensively. Longwood attacking the rim. And a reverse. Basket and a foul. Cooks committing the foul. Yes. So Winthrop has the ball. Possession arrow favors Longwood if we get into a jump ball. Here's Smith for three. Counted with 2-0-1 to move. A player like that. It's a great play that they set it up. Shot clock at seven. Davenport with the ball in his hands. In traffic to Cooks. The floater good with a minute 12 to play. In this game, he's had a couple of huge threes in this game. And has some big free throws here. Taylor, as the C's part, gets the easy layup. Longwood with eight seconds left. Rapu will put up a three with three seconds remaining. It's no good. And the rebound, Derek Henry. The clock will expire. There's the horn. And the Eagles win it 82 to 72.